here you see our mobile grow chamber. It's fitted in a 20 feet container, but it can also be fitted in a 40 feet container or it can be fitted in uh, regular existing buildings. What you see here on the right side is a system based on a conventional Danish trolley system. And also, with the add heat button, there's a drain, there's also air circulation and lights. Um, the, the air, the human air goes into this uh, air treatment unit yep. where it's dehumidified by means of cooling. Yep. Yep. And then the air is brought back into the system through those gaps, those slices over there, into the air chamber. Yep. You can see we have also uh, the sensor. If you remove the car, and also the water supply is stopped. So there are a lot of noise points, skillets of water, and things like that. If I'm correct, the system is modular and we can make different heights, correct? Yeah. The same as the Danish car, we have uh, in the system, we have the, the lights and then also the, the end plate on 5 centimeters, instead of 5 centimeters distance. So we can remove the lights simply by filling up and put it out. you see all the electrical systems, control systems, fertigation systems integrated in the back of the container module. Again, this can also be built in a conventional building, existing building. The chiller is outside, we make cold water, it's called the cold water tank over here. Then we have a cooling circuit with a mixing towel and a pump, a measuring. So we made cold water for the, for the cooling blocks. This is the the second part is the warm water. We have two boilers, or simple electrical boilers. Then we make the hot water, and these are also the pump, the mixing valve, and the, uh, and the temperature sensor. So we make the warm water. So drain pump over here. The drain pump drains the water from the, the three tanks inside and put it back into the storage tank outside. And that's the irrigation pump. And that irrigation pump makes, uh, puts, uh, keeps the uh, system on pressure. Extra two filter, the diesel and UV uh, uh, filter to uh, clean in the uh, water. So this is the A tank, G tank, fertilizer concentrate, yeah. acid, and it's injected in the irrigation system by means of these dosing pumps. Yeah. And it's a closed system, if I'm correct. Yeah. So we have a, a reservoir. Yep. where we have the fertigated water which is being pumped into the system. Two times a day, two times a day or ten times a day, you can adjust of course. So we have Hogendorn aspirator boxes inside the growth chamber that measures the climate, the humidity, uh, relative humidity, temperature. And we have the climate computer here with all the data points. Okay, well I hope this is uh, sort of a sneak preview and it basically explains the setup of the system.